What's going on, y'all? This is Big Matt 519, the Camp Life Squad, and I got a decent gameplay for you on Modern Warfare Remastered, TDM on the map backlog. And what I'm going to show you here is my opening route when I'm on this side of the map, where I like to go and camp, and I got this spot from watching my boy Lost Souls. So, I'm, you know, big shout out to you. I'm going to show them the spot that we like to hold, well, that you hold, and now I'm loving to hold. But here you go. We're going to cut through this window and then go right up these stairs. And it's got a good vantage point all the way down to the other end. Now you drop a claymore right here. For anybody that comes up. Because there is a spawn point to our left behind us. Where we have spawned from. So you know the enemy can spawn there. And I'll put another one inside the wind, inside the doorway. For the niggas running juggernaut. Now you can see right there. He's running juggernaut. But I got an assist on him. I should have got the kill. But from here. Like you said there's a sniper spot right there up on that roof. Spawn all the way to the right where my um, teammate just ran through. That's another spawn point where they come through. And you see, they're spawning on our end because all my whole team's on the other side, so that's their spawn to come out from where we came. So you sit back here, you can pick them off one by one. I was looking to see if there was a window on that side, but there wasn't. So they could um, catch them all the way across the map on that metal, you know, that half constructed building over there. That's where all the snipers like to go. So you see a teammate jumping up and down trying to get a kill. That's another good spot. But if you stay right here and you be patient, you camp like a boss. Look, you see, they're coming. This, this is the perfect spot to be in. Now, you can't stay here all day. The block is going to get hot. They're going to throw grenades. You know these people love spamming grenades up here. But you, you should be able to get a couple of nice kill streaks going. You know, look, now I got the radar. Pop that up. I wish they had scavenger because I run out of bullets too fast with this gun. Plus my aim is ass. Look, see? I could I should have killed him. I'm gonna throw a grenade up there for good measure, see if what happens. Probably bounced off. Who knows? But yeah, this is my opening route. I like this building right here, it's pretty good. You get a couple of nice kills. Anyway. That's how we do it on this side. Now I'll show you another spot coming up soon that I learned from Delta. That it's got a pretty nice little vantage point if you're sniping. You can catch them coming, you know. On There's another spawn point over there and you could spawn trap them if your team is on the other end. But I'll show you that in a few once we get to it. Anyway, I want to talk about my, um, Infinite Warfare and why would you bring out COD points for Infinite Warfare now before Christmas? My opinion is, you know, you're not making any sales. Your beta, after the beta came out, your sales didn't increase the way you wanted to. So now you got those cop points out there. So, you know, you can make your money. Infinity Ward, I think you fucked up this year with this game, with um, IW. Somebody's going to lose their job. You had three full years to develop a game. And all you did was copy and paste Black Ops 3 into here. Reskinned it a little. Put some shit ass score streaks and called it a day. Well, you're gonna learn. And that's why I think the next card that's gonna come out is gonna have to be boots on the ground. I mean that's what everybody wants. Even the pro players are complaining about IW that it's not that great. They don't even feel like wanting to do competitive with it. They rather rock this competitive this year than IW. And if the pro players are complaining you know something's going to happen. Because, I mean, they're the minority in the whole scheme of the Call of Duty. The pro players are the minority. There ain't that many of them. But they hold a lot of weight. got to make them happy. So I'm pretty sure the next card is going to be boots on the ground. At least in my opinion, that's the way I think it's going to go. But who the fuck am I, right? I'm just Big Matt 519. Camp Live Squad, biatch. But, um, anyway, this block is starting to get hot. They know I'm here. And they're going to be um, coming at me in a minute. They're going to snipe me out of this spot. Shoot me out of there. And then I'm going to make it around to, my, to the other side. So, anyway, this gameplay is going to go. I'm going to be out. I got to do some family things. I'm going to let this run. Play a little music. Enjoy the rest of it. Until next time. Big Matt 519 Camp Life Squad. And we out this bitch. Peace.
one more thing before I go. I want to tell you about that other spot that I learned from Delta, and here it is. You come up to these steps, jump over this ledge, boom, you're in this little cubby hole. I mean, they can see you, but it's a good vantage point coming out. There's a spawn to the left around that wall, and once they come up through there, boom, you catch them all day. Well, anyway, see, I got a hit mark on someone. And there goes this fool just standing up on the stairs, got him. He didn't see me, he came right up. Now I'm going to leave and uh, enjoy the rest of the video. But here's that spot I was talking to you about. Anyway, this is Big Matt 509, Camp Life Squad. And we out this bitch again. Peace.